Welcome to a CNC parts and services test video. Now, right now uh, we're testing uh, one of our RG3 IB controllers with a RISC card on the side. I uh, will go through it. Uh, first of all, I'm just going to start up the control right now and show you the startup sequence. I have also the, the eye pendant. It's all starting up. But make the note of the serial numbers because actual uh, the item we actually testing it's the item you'll be getting uh, especially on the motherboard on the power supply so you know everything is uh, working nice and uh, everything is in good running order The control is starting up right now, and this way, you know, uh, I can make sure you know that uh, everything FFSB card, you know, the access card is running, the extension card, it's it's uh, everything is okay and uh, operational. It's almost done. We're starting up. I'm actually on the alarm screen, so we should soon see all of the alarms. There's something uh, wrong with it. Okay, we do have a deadman switch released and a pulse mismatch. This is actually a, a normal alarm because uh, my original controller's got um, encoder, encoder uh, uh, values for the motor. Actually, encoder positions are different than in my control, original one, and the one we're testing right now. So that's why we do have the pulse mismatch error which will actually mean we need to remaster, you know, uh, remaster this control uh, to new positions in the, um, on the robot. But we're not going to do it because if I will do it on this control, I'll actually have to, I'll have to remaster it right here on mine. So I'm just going to bring it up into ready state, releasing the deadman switch. You can actually see we have all green lights on a servo, so FFSB card is working fine. And all the memory cards, uh, CPUs, everything, uh, risk card, everything is in nice working order. Thank you for watching and uh, this actually controller will uh, will put uh, uh, for parts. So we we'll just part it out. Uh, we put each part separately, including the memory chips, including the power supply. But actually, uh, you can actually identify it uh, just uh, the motherboard, the power supply itself and the, and the side uh, card right here by the serial number which is on the on the end and this one is actually 500743 the memory cards you just have to take our word on that they are actually inside this control and uh, everything is running fine on it so everything is nice working order thank you for watching the video and uh, i hope we do some nice business thank you so much and talk to you later bye bye